All right, guys. We are uh, cutting up the ingredients to make some uh, ceviche, something I never had before. And now I have two right here making it, and we're gonna try it out, see how it tastes like, because I've never tried it. And he said it's good, so. He's a master chef right there. Yeah. With the culinary uh, school. Got his masters in it. Look at that technique. <laughs> now you cut them in pieces, and then what's dice them? And dice them. Slicing and dicing. All right, now we're cutting up the tomatoes. We're slicing them and dicing them. That's how you do it right there, guys. Like that. Alright. Alright. Now I can put in the bowl right here. You got that tomatoes and that jalapenos. No, it's bell pepper. No. Yeah, bell pepper. Cut them up, put them in a the bowl. Now he's cutting up the onions. So that was hot, or was it? What kind of onion is that? These are the. What do you call these? There. <laughs> I know they're the they're onions. <laughs> <laughs> the purple onions. Purple onions have, give it, have a little bit more heat. This will give it like a different texture, right? It just gives it a little bit more heat than the white ones. White ones right. are too sweet. This will make you make you cry. <laughs> they stay crying onions. We <laughs> <They're> call <crying. laughs> these the cry onions. Stir them up. That's good. All right, guys. Now we're gonna fillet these pig fish right here that we caught at the coast, and uh, hopefully I can do it right and not cut through. Messing up already. Trying to get to the belly side. How's that for the fillet, huh? Now let's do the other side. Like that. Another one. 
Hopefully it'll be a lot easier. Try not to get the, the bones in there. Cut the other way. Like that on the meat. All right, All right guys, I'm nope. here using the spoon. That's my trick right here that I use to fillet them. Just kind of squeeze it from the back tail. Use that knife. Try not to cut all the way down. Well, like that. See that white meat? We have all these red meat on there. Did you have it too low? Like that. So I didn't cut all the way because it's all red meat in there. Just like that. guys now we're gonna slice it and then cube it you know slice and dice I just stacked it up all right now I'm just gonna cut it the other way now Cube. It says slice and dice. You cut it bigger? No, the smaller the better. It cooks faster. Yeah, the smaller you get, the faster it cooks. Now, guys, this is my first time doing it, so well, I'm just filleting the fish and cutting it in pieces, just like that. What did you do? That way be better. Smaller. Alright guys, now we're gonna put the rest of these right here in this bowl. Throw them in here. All right, guys, now I'm just gonna smush it. Get all that juice in there. So when I cut it, I don't have to squeeze the heck out of it. All right, I'm just gonna cut it in half. It's coming out already, just like that. Now we're gonna cover this juice right here. And what does it do again too? The acid and the lime is going to cook the uh, fish meat. 
Yeah, I heard that. It takes about probably 30 minutes or so. So we're gonna try to cover this meat right here with all these lime. This is something I've never tried before. Now how do you know when it's done? The uh, fish meat will turn white when it's done. You can see right now where it's kind of clear looking. When it's done, it'll be white. Like regular fish? Yep. Like your yellowfin fish. Make sure you get all that juice. Get the more. Or is it doing good? All right, one more. One more. Get this juice covered up. The fishy. How's that? That's good. Cover it up and wait 30 minutes. She's done. Alright guys, what? Not even a minute. She's turning white already. Now we just gotta throw the lid on her. Let's leave it for 30 minutes. Make sure it's good to go before we get it stirred up with these. Alright. So we'll be back. Big bowl. All right, guys. First We're gonna mix all these stuff up together, and we kept the lemon lime in there, and we added like four shrimp. Well, we have four shrimp, fresh shrimp. You can see that. All right, you cut up little small pieces, and we just mixed it up. Add a little bit of salt, and what else you put in there? Salt. That's it. Just the salt. Just salt. All right, and uh, just eat them with uh, tostitos or any kind you want. All right. Just like that. Just scoop it up, put it on your chips, and you just eat them. All right, guys. And this is my first time trying it. This thing's pretty good. How you like it, Mark? I'm gonna need you to pass me that bowl back. Right, for real. <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah. <laughs> Second. And two right here is the one made it. It's pretty I'm good, talking. man. It's pretty good. First time. <laughs> we like I just it. Like the... Yeah. I'm telling you, man. Chef two. <laughs> Look at him. He, 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 he don't know how to act no more. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to put too much on there. Too good. It's double stack. <laughs> well, guys, I hope you guys enjoy the videos. And uh, hit that like button and subscribe, right? Until then.